What if Stuart McGill's career didn't overlap with the great Shane Warne? McGill played 44 tests in his 10 year career, mostly through the old game miss from the King and also when the conditions required two spinners. To McGill's credit he actually outperformed Warne in those 16 tests. Warney missed the entire 98 season with a shoulder injury and the entire 2003 season after taking a banned substance. It was McGill's time to shine with some consistent game time. So it made me wonder, what if his career started in 2008 instead of finishing? What if he got a full 10 year career instead of bits and pieces? Stuart McGill would have played 100 tests for Australia between the years of 2008 and 2018. He would have taken a mammoth 511 wickets, which is the 8th most of all time. He could have been a modern day great. Not ideal for Nathan Lyon though.